Let's talk a bit about uh, some legislation that's, that you're hoping are, uh, to get passed, including the Electoral Count Act, which we were talking about. Uh, your party is close to passing the newly renamed Inflation Reduction Act. Uh, there are reports now that uh, Senator Cinema has issues with the bill. What's your sense of where we are with this bill? And have you had a chance to speak to, to Kirsten Cinema about her concerns? Uh, I've talked to her about other issues this week, including the Electoral Count Act, gay marriage. Um, she's supportive of uh, putting that into law. Um, and I know she's negotiating with Senator Schumer. She also is someone that believes in doing something about climate change. And her state's Arizona. They've got a lot of had issues with fires, heat, as you know, record temperatures. I think we'll get this done. But let's talk about what this bill will be and is. This bill is the game changer. $300 billion in deficit reduction. And all these economists who've looked at it have said that's why it's called the Inflation uh, Reduction Act. Uh, Number two, taking on pharmaceuticals. First time, I have been leading this effort for years. Finally, finally, we're telling the pharma companies, no, you wrote into law this ban on negotiating for less expensive Mm -hmm. drugs under Medicare. That's going away. We're lifting it. Uh, investment in climate change to the point that we're going to see a 40 percent reduction by the year 2030. So we are bullish and excited about this bill. We're going to get it done by this time next week. That bill will be done. And let's look at these other accomplishments, Allie. I'm sorry, but this is not just that the Republicans been extreme. It's we are getting things done. NATO, just Sweden yep. and Finland, we got them Approved, into yep. the sign the treaty today um, and got that through the U.S. Senate. Uh, the burn pit. Our veterans finally are going to get the help that they need. We got that done despite Republicans messing around with it. Um, we got the chips bill done. So now 13 percent are now made in America. We're going to go way up with that number. So we're finally making the semiconductor chips that we need for Mm -hmm. our cars and for our phones. Gun safety legislation. Who thought that was ever possible? Well, Chris Murphy did and a number of other senators who've been working on this, including myself on closing the boyfriend loophole, worked with Republicans and for the first time took on the NRA and got that done. Uh, The number two terrorists (laughs) who... um, and not from 9-11, finally, and the president authorized this operation to take him down. It is day after day after yep. day we are accomplishing things for the people of this country. And so that's what I want people to take away. Yes, the Republicans have shown their true colors. But the Democrats, we're willing to work around the aisle, across the aisle, and we can find common ground. And we have a president that's leading, and we're moving forward. All right. Well, that was about 10 topics in there. So you and I are going to need a little bit more time to. They're uh, all good ones. They're all all good topics. They're all good topics. But these are things that in these news cycles, people forget about or they don't remember. They don't understand how they got done. So we, we have to just keep on talking about them. And I appreciate the time you take to do that, Senator. Thank you. Anytime. Senator Amy Klobuchar, chair of the Senate Rules Committee, uh, joining us tonight.